Here we see Floyd Fronius walking his air chair, the Red Goat, down to the launch at the Torrey Pines Glider Port in San Diego, California. It's December 2009 and the wind is strong. This glider weighs about the same as the pilot, light enough to be lifted off the ground by the wind. As he walks it down the hill, Floyd is flying the glider with his right hand on the control stick. In the air, the GOAT will fly about the same speed as a hang glider, and it will be sharing the local ridge lift and landing area with hang gliders and paragliders. At this site, GOAT launches are made by rolling down a slope, but it can also be launched from a runway by tow line. Cliff launches in strong wind conditions are often not smooth. In this wind, the glider floats off the launch without needing much ground roll. For a GOAT, 30 miles per hour is a fast airspeed. So into this headwind, Floyd can fly straight out, float upward, and still be in the lift. An air chair is a type of ultralight sailplane, a fixed wing glider with a tail, where the pilot sits out in the open air. Sailplane skills are required since the GOAT is flown with ordinary sailplane stick and rudder controls. The GOAT is now making a fast downwind approach, banking sharply into the back of the landing hill. Once on the ground, it won't roll very far due to its light weight and the high winds. After stopping, it can be rolled fo forward for another launch. Unassisted launches are preferred because the pilot has good control and he wants to feel how the glider is responding without interference from a wing helper. In the air, the pilot will be searching for lift, usually trying to get up as high as possible where the view is good, the air is smooth, and he is high above the beach. Landing again, the goat banks into position, then lines up for landing on the back side of the hill, skimming the grass, then floating up as far as possible. Now the goat is down and finished with a satisfying day of soaring.